Look at the time, it's late o'clock with Rob Hunter. Rob Hunter. One more time, JT from Tripod, ladies and gentlemen. Hi. Hi, JT. How are you doing? Good, thanks so much for being here. That Hi. was very good. Very good really? comedy song. Songs? <laughs> thanks. Yeah. Well done. Yeah, thanks, man. It's really nice to be here. Been a fan for a long time. Oh, good. Good, good. So, you are in the musical band Tripod? Yes. Yes. And uh, you play the little bald guy? <laughs> Sorry, no, no, no. no. curly head douche. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, that's my role. That's my character. Great. Yes. And uh, you guys have been around. You've been around for quite a while. I remember watching you on Hey Hey It's Saturday some years ago. Yeah, a long time and, ago. Uh, yeah, and uh, you've done a lot since. People might know you from Triple J in the early two thousands. Yeah, maybe. And uh, you've released a, a dozen or so albums. An amazing, an amazing career. Uh, do you know what my favourite song is? What's that? Electric Blue. <laughs> ice House. That's an Ice House uh, song. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Little joke there. No, I see what's, I no. see what's happening now. Stop, it's good. Hey, can I, show you, can I show you something? <laughs> Don't touch my things. Can I show you something? Go. You, uh, you can con confirm this is true. You co-hosted the Raw National Final in 2005. Sure. That's true. And I was a national finalist that year. It's a, co it's a comedy competition for young comedians. For kids, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was a kid back then. Yeah, right. Yes. Okay. And right. I was doing very well. I made the final. And, uh, I haven't seemed to have grown much. In <laughs> uh, mature or develop in any way, but that's good. Sorry. Just, uh, some manners don't go astray at times. So. <laughs> I thought that was the... Okay, all right, fair enough. <laughs> Back to my, my story. Um, <laughs> as, as part of the, uh, the prize pack I got for, for being in the national final, I got given a poster. Oh, yeah. And uh, I've got it here. Um, and I didn't go searching for autographs or anything, but uh, when, I, when I got it in my gift bag, um, two of the members of Tripod had signed it. There's Jon, and that's God, and he even drew me a little picture... And you that's can confirm nice. that's true, isn't it? Yeah, that's what he does. That's yeah, yeah, those yeah. are your bandmates' autographs. That's it. And There's one name conspicuously <laughs> absent. Can you? I was a young comedian at the time. I looked up to you. Yeah. In past tense, you looked up. Was no, but um, I can. I'll probably have to rush off because I think that year I was doing another show. So, do you want me, I could. I could. <laughs> I could fix. Do you want me to sign it for you? I don't want you to sign it. I want you to get me a new poster that hasn't been defaced by your bullshit band. <laughs> Talk a little about, little bit about your. Uh, let's talk about your style of comedy. Sure. I'm a, I'm a big fan. Like I say, the thing, the thing that I find often though about musical comedy is that it's often neither of those things. <laughs> like, um, but I really, I really love it. I genuinely yeah. really love it, and that must be reassuring as a writer because like the jokes aren't great, and the music that accompanies it isn't good. But together, they're amazing. Like, a good equivalent is, um, like, Keanu Reeves and Gary Busey on their own, not that great. But together, they made Point Break, <laughs> which is awesome. You see? You see what I'm saying? I think I, think I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We sort of, you know, we, I mean, we spend a lot of time doing, we, we spend a lot of work actually putting those things together, trying to okay. make it as satisfying musically as it is sort of comedically. I, I can understand why you would think that. Yeah. yeah. Um, you, know, Get out. You, know what, you know what my favourite part of musical comedy is? Go. Is it, it rhymes sometimes. <laughs> sometimes, like, you, you, you listen to the words and you think, this isn't anything, but then a word comes along that sounds a little bit like another word and you go... That's comedy. There you are. Where were you? And it's like, there you are. You were hiding. Actually, I think, you know, sometimes rhyming can be quite hard. Timing Randy kite lard. <laughs> what do you... 
What are you saying? <laughs> Slot car poo paying. That doesn't even make sense. You can't just you can't just say any sort of rhyme that that I mean. No? There's no. I mean, they're laughing because it's so fucking absurd. <laughs> but. You can't actually get away with that for an hour, do you know what I mean? Maybe the problem was that I didn't repeat the same joke four or five times. <laughs> you think? <laughs> do, you th um, do, you th do, you do you think maybe that was the problem? Hey, uh, maybe uh, maybe Luke would like to try to rhyme with Gatesy. Luke, would you uh, would you like that? Would you like to try and rhyme with Gatesy? Yes. <laughs> All right. Um, He's going to rhyme with you. Give him a chance. Okay. How's this? Um, this interview is a bit of a fucking waste of time, and you're an idiot. <laughs> F you, Gatesy. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh, just, um, just, just doing a sound check. Just, got it, um, just do it. Uh, how are you doing? I'm Jason English, pop how rocketeer. Oh, rock, pop rocketeer. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm the musical comedian in the show. <laughs> Jason? Um, I'm Gatesy um, from Tripod. I've never heard of you. <laughs> Jason, oh, you're, Jason. You're doing raw this year. Stop it, Jason. Well, you stop it. You get up. You wait till your bit. <laughs> sorry, sorry about that, Gatesy. No. Can I call you Gatesy? Yeah. yeah. Um, one thing, one thing people would know you from is uh, your days on Triple J, as I mentioned. And yes. one of the things you used to do there was um, the song in an hour challenge. The yes. band would be given a, a topic and a style and you'd go away and you'd come back with, with a, a brand new song mm. based entirely on that. And uh, it actually went really well to the point where you put out a couple of albums mm -hmm. of the best ones That's and uh, people really loved them. Mm -hmm. um, we don't have an hour, but we do have a few minutes. Yeah. Would you... Uh, you want to do a song with me? Do you sing? Of course. <laughs> well. Would you be uh, willing to do that? Want to try uh, a song with me? Sure. Love? Do you want to? You serious? Want to get you? To, yeah. Okay. All right. Let right. me try. Um, what kind of vibe do All you right. want to go for? So I was thinking, like, uh, maybe a song about how musical comedy rhymes and that's how it's funny and so if you do a line and then I'll I'll come in with mine and we'll make a song okay. like that. No, all right. All right. Okay. All right. Um what I do sing is 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 perfect, but if if you could just keep it between ha and ha, that'd be I don't know <laughs> what those are in musical <laughs> so, um. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Um Luke, can you uh, can you give us a note to uh, tune to? Uh. Great, thanks, buddy. Does that help? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Take it away. Um. <laughs> so I just start. You do you a line, and I'll, okay. I'll uh, not too long. All right. Okay. <laughs> this song is funny cause it rhymes. Ping pong, this bunny forest limes. <laughs> I see where this is going. <laughs> My name is Gatesy, I'm with Tripod. Fly lame his grapeseed, climb in my dog. <laughs> Rob Hunter is a massive asshole. Rob Hunter isn't a big asshole. <laughs> 
I think we'll stop this song right now. My stink feels cop this dong tight cow. And the obligatory round of applause because it's a song. Gatesy, ladies and gentlemen. There was a time it was eight o'clock with Rob Hunter.